Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in New York City at the Department of Parks and Recreation where we find Davy Boy or Vampire Dave or Dracula or whatever the hell you want to call him as he attempts to barge his way into the office and become a royal pain in the ass for the guards in that building, only to find himself being escorted out of the building uh, by the two security guards. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Got activism. 61st Street, Broadway. Hello, how you doing? How can I help uh, you? Good morning, how are you? Hello? Hi. Hello, hello, hello. Now, there are a couple things to take note of here. First of all, uh, he walks right up to the door and it is locked. Now, if you'll notice to the right, there is a key card access point, a key card reader. So this building is obviously secure, so therefore not exactly open to the public. But this Nimrod is going to argue that it is open to the public. I mean, come on now, Davy Boy. If the door was locked and there's a key card uh, reader on there, it's not exactly open to the public, dumbass. Hello, how can I help you? Excuse me, how can I help you? Please don't touch me, thank you. Excuse me, this is not a building for just anyone to just walk in. So if you have business here, how can I help you? You let me in, ma'am. Um, how can I help you? I'm okay. Just looking for now. Okay, so I guess you could head out that way. Because you, you don't have business here. And it's not a public apartment? building. Yes, I do, and What's it's not name? a public building. Come on, we can head out this way, though. What's your Come name? On. Come on. Man, what's your name? Come on. You cannot do that. That's people's personal business. Sorry. Why are you touching me? Sorry. Why are you touching me? You gotta go this way. Why are you touching me? You gotta go this way. Yeah, the moron walked into a building that's not open to the public and tried to actually did film people's personal information on the counter and uploaded it to the internet. And I just took it out because, you know, it's people's actual personal information. So, dude, this is what I've been saying all this time. They are going to film your personal information and they are going to put it on the internet. This moron just proved that they will do that. So now uh, Davy Boy has proven that uh, he tends to make life easier for identity thieves in scenarios like this. Congratulations, uh, Davy. You are a freaking moron. Excuse me. You got to come out the building. Can't even go. Come on. You got to go out the business. You can't take no pictures of that book. Sorry. Come on. I need your come name. On. Can we go, please? When I get your name, I'll leave. All right. I'm going to tell you out here. Come on. Tell me your name and I'll Come leave. Come on, I'm gonna tell you right out here. Come on. Come on. Tell me your name and I'll leave. Come on, we gotta go this way. Come on, sir. I came here to ask information. I can right, do that. I'm so you can just waltz right in here and get information. Uh, dude, the key card reader outside says otherwise. Trying. I can come in here and I can ask for information. Okay, so what's the information? So what's your name? How can I help you? Because you walked past me before you came. So I didn't walk nowhere. I Where can I go? Did Excuse I go over me? there? Did I go in the elevator? No. So how can I help you? I didn't go past you. I've been here the whole time. How can I help you? I need your name. How can I help you? I just told you. I need your name. How can I help you? I just told you, ma'am. How can I help you? I need your name so I can hold you accountable for putting your hands on me. I you felt real. Way. You felt real. Just like this. You were real confident and getting in my face you and putting your hands on me. Names. So why not be confident? And give me your name. Names. Come on, we gotta go out the building. Once I get your name, I'll leave. Come on, I'll tell you when we out here. It's not the way it works. You work for me. I don't work for you. Um, oh really? So you pay taxes, therefore. You're uh, her boss. Uh, no, it doesn't work that way, dude. Uh, your uh, tax contribution to this whole thing is probably point zero 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 one percent of all of the state of New York's combined 
tax uh, a contribution to her salary. So, no, you don't own her. You don't boss her around. You are nothing but a peon yourself. Sorry, I don't want to You do. What's your name? My apologies. Come on. Um, so, he don't want to go out the building, but as you see that, he's recording. So, yeah. I told all of you once I get her name. And I said I can tell you my name once we out here. That's not the I way it works. I'll and tell you. I have no problem. I don't have to stand in the cold to get public mm-hmm. information, man. I'm here. What are you looking for? Is that he, he's her not name? He's looking for anything. I'm looking for your name. I he's said that four times. I said that like five times. I need your name. But what are you here for? Nothing. To get her name. You already know. So you're here for nothing, basically, except to be a royal pain in the ass, like the typical frauditor you are, instead of being a productive member of society and actually going out to get a job and, uh, well, try to make improvements on the world instead of being a detriment to it. Is that right? You already know. I just want her name, and I'll leave Cause she she put her hands on me. She yelled in my I face. Just like this. It's on camera. He was standing right here. I said just like this. Right you cut in front. So, you cut in front of me. And is, is there cameras in the stuff? Yep. So if you're not if you're not in the business, or you have to. I just I just told you my business four times. I need her name so I can address my government. That is business. Do what you gotta do. I need her name so I can leave. You was real confident putting your hands on me, but you don't want to be no, confident giving your name. So write your name down. Write your name down for me so I can leave. Yeah. That's it. She, she, she let me in. That means I, she, gained, she granted me access. And I came here. I was asking. I need to ask a question. I need her name. I was just looking at that sign and I was going to leave. Oh, no. That's not what happened, you despicable lying little frauditor. Uh, as soon as she asked you to leave, you went over to that book and decided to f- start filming personal information and you decided to upload it to the internet later on after your sorry ass got home so no that's not what went down you once again you're a liar she's getting mad no, loud came, came right everything's here. on camera he man okay if you don't want me to see that close it if you don't want me to see it close it that's it i just told you my business four times that's the sixth time i told you my business that's business. Is Gathering public business. information is business. I just told you. I just told you seven times what I'm here for. I would have left already if I need I need her name. She works for the public. She put her hands on me. So why you can't do that outside the door? That's what we asked for you. Because it's cold outside. I don't have to get information. I don't have to get information outside in the cold, ma'am. She let me in. So I can come in and ask questions. All right, so we just gonna have to police this All right, that's yeah. fine. Do what you gotta do. Yeah, we are gonna do what we gotta do. That's All right, I know where you was at. I know what time. I'm gonna, right. I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk and play. What's your name? You a security guard, right? Come on. We outside. We get your name outside. What's your name, man? My name is outside. Your name is outside. Yes. All right. It's funny how the public Thank employees you. act on yes, camera. No All right. Oh, she roasted him, and uh, he ended up falling for that little trick right there. Oh, Davy boy, you really were born yesterday, weren't you? You've got to be one of the dumbest frauditors out there. But hold on a second. He figures it out and goes back for more. A little longer than a few minutes later. Can't I can't come in. Sorry, no. That sign clearly says visitors. That sign clearly says visitors. You can't come in. Come on. Excuse me. You can't hold the door open with his foot. I can come in and conduct business. Yes, I can. You can't, you can't have this door open like this. Come on. I'm trying to enter. Excuse us. That sign clearly says visitors. Sorry. It's okay. Let me speak to your supervisor, please. I want to speak to your Spoiler alert, uh, the manager is not going to come, and this idiot is still not going to be allowed back in the building. I mean, after all, why the hell would they let him back in the building when he was clearly there to cause trouble? I mean, the very fact that he walked up to a book that had private information on it and filmed it 
basically means he's not there to conduct business. He's there to be a pain in the ass. So why would they do that? I'm going to call him right now. Call Come him. On. Come here. And I can wait in. in that lobby where it's warm. Excuse me. Coming in here. You can't deny are you the forcing entry, us from not closing the door? I'm trying to enter. Are you are blocking you my way? Us from not are you closing blocking the my door? entry? Excuse me. Are you denying me entry? Excuse me. Are you denying me entry? Are you denying me entry? No, bozo. The very fact that there is a key card reader on that wall over there means that it's not open to the public. So therefore, they're doing their jobs in keeping the scumbags like you out of the door. Excuse me. You're excused. Can you please excuse your foot? No, I have business to conduct in this building. Excuse me. You can't come, come in this building. In here. You see that sign right there? That sign clearly says business. I just. It doesn't matter. I told you my business. I told you my business. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. You cannot come in the building. You're making it hard for yourself. It doesn't matter. Come on. I was trying to make it. Clearly, they're allowing other people access and not me. That's discrimination. Are you sure it's discrimination, dude? Because look at the uh, people that are standing at the doorway right now. It's a mixture of uh, race and gender. Uh, so are you being discriminated based on your color? No, because three out of the four people here are African-American. Uh, are you being discriminated against because of your gender? No, because... There are a mixture of men and women in here, so are you being discriminated against uh, due to a uh, disability? No, because you're neither mentally or physically disabled. Well, maybe mentally, because you do seem to be quite incompetent and incapable of uh, being able to look up definitions or anything like that for proper usage so you don't make yourself look like a complete and total moron. So seeing as how this was a rather long video and he pretty much stands around for the next 10 minutes going in circles with them, I'm not going to do that because I hate circular reasoning. So let's go ahead and roll that beautiful bean footage and uh, skip to the end, shall we? Many, many minutes later. Because you guys don't want to be held accountable. You just want to run rampant, do whatever you want, treat the public however you want to treat us. Mm -mm. And you want to hide your name. Your name is public information. And I'll find it and I'll hold you accountable. Thank you, honey. Which I have the right to do. You work for the government, I have the right to redress my government. If I don't feel, if I feel like you guys treated me bad, and I'm going to request that, that camera footage right there. How far away is your Ma'am, you cannot, you cannot die. Go ahead. I'll let you. I'll wait right here for you. Okay, you'll let him. Okay. Yeah, sure. And the very fact that you can't get in there without key card access is, well, one way that you're not going to be able to get back in there. Oh, man, Davy boy, you certainly are a pathetic little tool, aren't you? So at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. And I will see you on the next one. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's- Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that?